Hey fans, welcome back. We're here for more double trouble for trouble maker. Four more chapters left. And now I just hooked up with my bro stepbrother. Even though I have no idea if that's gross to you or not. So let's go. My head is spinning. I hooked up with JJ. I told you! I can't believe it. But he's been so nice and sweet and wonderful and I just don't want the night to end. Good morning, beautiful. When did you we fall asleep? I don't remember last night. Last night was wonderful. I know. I should probably sneak back to my room before they notice I'm not there. You, yeah, they're probably not. Knowing those two, they'll be up any second. JJ! Uh, uh Jeff? Oh, good. Come on, you're, uh, you're already up. Yeah, that's right. I'm up and awake after a night of sleeping in my bed. Good! Just a huge sleep in my bed and with no one else around, right, JJ? That's 100% correct. Well, I'm glad you both had a good sleep. This night, this is nice, seeing you two, two of you together like this. Oh, God, he knows that I'm going to jail or something. You two look great together. Like a couple, brother and sister, step-brother and sister, and not related by blood at all. We didn't even know each other a couple of months ago. We don't even think about of each other like that. I know, but seeing you now, it's clear to, that you two are going to make wonderful, make some wonderful memories together. Okay, this is getting too weird. Thanks, Pop, but I'm not sure you didn't have to come here just to give us awkward compliments. That's right, Caroline. Your mom and I have to go into work, but we have fittings today for the dress and tuxes. We need the two of you to try go in and try them on. Try our mom's wedding dress? Yep, that's right. She said that she's just about your size. The ladies in your family sure do trim, don't they, JJ? Yeah, uh, sure. Yeah, I don't know. I left the address downstairs. Call me if there's any, if there are any issues. Thanks, kids. JJ, Jeff, you're so weird sometimes. That was weird. Did, did we make a mistake? This Is this going to get bad? Of course not. Last night was incredible. We're not related and we don't and we won't be. Maybe we should shut up uh suggesting they might be happier not marry game. I don't think that would hurt. We better get a move on. I don't wanna gra I wanna grab a bite. Where? We could head to a coffee shop or grab some uh breakfast. Sounds fantastic. I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm gonna get fat. I don't mean to be rude, but you, you really put away those waffles. What else was I supposed to do? Fried chicken and waffles are my jam. Wait, ah, uh, too much, too full to laugh. Ow. You're not going to be able to fit in the dress. Speak for yourself. There will be plenty of room. Maybe room for two if you, if you play your cards right. Okay, we better get going. Oh, God. Oh, no. Turn around. Is there a back door? What? Don't be silly. Let's go. But he'll see me. Elliot. Oh, yeah. Caroline? Hey, Elliot. I heard you and Brody broke up. Makes sense. I mean, he did get my sister pregnant. And you must be soon to be a stepbrother. Brother. That's causing him all the stir. I'm JJ. Elliot. Elliot's brother and Caroline's ex-boyfriend. Your ex-boyfriend? I didn't know that. It was a million years ago. Yep, before she had her stint as Brody's girlfriend, right around the time he got my twin sister pregnant. Earlier attends military school. That's why you haven't been blessed with his presence. Yeah, I tried to go back to school with you guys, but I miss the, but I miss the structure and discipl the discipline, the feeling like I was accomplished something. Good for you. Yes, good for me. I'll be seeing you. Your ex-boyfriend? What's so funny? Between him and Brody, you have terrible tasting guys. I get it, okay? So what does that say about you? Hey, handsome. Have you been waiting long? Nah, guess who I just saw? That was fun. A fun distraction with JJ, but seeing Elliot kind of messed it all up. I don't know what I ever saw in that guy. I don't know either. I don't know what what 
what the heck he was doing in there. Weird. Not bad. Not bad at all. The fit looks is wonderful. You look so handsome. Thank you. I gotta say, it's not my normal look, but I'm into it. Where is the beautiful bride to be? Finishing up and getting changed. Caroline, is it too much? Is it? It's too much, isn't it? No, you look incredible. Really? Yeah, like a dream, honestly. Let's see, let's see. The bride and groom together. Like, go stand next to JJ? Certainly. I must see the two of you next to each other to get, to get the full picture. To get the full picture, my bad. This is... Th it's weird, right? Actually, I was going to say, it's kind of cool. Yeah, that too. You look fantastic. Thank you, beautiful. So, are you? Are we happy? Oh, the two of you look like the happiest young couple I've ever seen. Thank you, but we're not... When is the big day? It's in a few weeks, but it's not us. What do you mean? You're probably the most beautiful young couple I've ever seen. Just babies, but I can tell you're going to make it. I can see it in your eyes. I'm sorry, but we're not the ones getting married. Our parents, your brother and sister? No, well, kind of. My mom is marrying his dad. We're not related at all. Well, then, thank goodness you're not getting married. I think that's a crime. Oh, now you change your mind. Wow. Yeah. What are you going to wear to the wedding? You know, something old, something new, something borrowed, something blue? Mom wants me to wear something blue. Great. Then let's get you a new dress benefiting the maid of honor. Oh, no, don't worry about it. I miss, I insist. Excuse me, ma'am. Well, we were wondering what dress you have for the maid of honor in blue. I'm sure we could come up with something gorgeous, dear. Let's get you front and center. Excellent. Let, let's take a look. Wow. Is it okay? That That's perfect. You are trying to brighten that one, darling. Straight off the runways of Paris. I like it. Really? Yeah, really? As bad as my dress go, it could be worse. At least I'm not showing off my butt. This is a dress for me. I'll get you everything wrapped up for you, brother and sister. Oh, so cute. So, brother and sister. Yeah, that's us. We can't let that happen, can we? We have to stop this wedding. I think so. I'm feeling a, a lot right now, but it all goes back to you. Do, do you want me to be? Do you want to be with me? Something told told me that Brody Mary getting uh, Alice pregnant was the universe giving me the freedom to find what I what I really want. Sounds like a smart guy. Who said that? Yep, smart and handsome. Love it. You obviously. Yeah, so yeah, I want to embrace the freedom to find what I really want. And that might be just me, you. Before I could plant a kiss on JJ, my phone rang. Is that your phone? Hello? Never in a million years could I have guessed who was on the other end of the call. And nothing could have prepared me for the for where it took me that night. Who? Dinner with? Your dad! My dad! Hi, honey. Oh, my gosh! Daddy, what did you get out? They, they released me this afternoon. I have to see my girl. Have you talked to mom? Just to her lawyers. They're less than for forthcoming with her wishes. Wishes? I don't know what she wants, sweetie. I'm assuming that's what you're asking. You mean, are you guys getting back together? Yes, and to be honest, I don't know. But I have a lot of time to think in that cell, and there's a word of things I would do differently. You need to talk to mom. I want to. I will. I promise. You know she's getting married? Yes. But she's been... You have to talk to her. Find out what she wants, where her heart is, and where her head is. I know, sweetheart. But if your mother has chosen to move forward with this guy, I don't know if me getting out of prison makes a difference. Maybe it's fate. I thought my love light was going to go one way. But then something happened, and that it's in a totally different direction. Maybe that's what's happening with you guys too. You're always, you are always so smart. I'll be right back, honey. Nature calls. Oh my God, I get to see my dad again. If my dad is trying to get back together with my mom, maybe JJ and I don't have to stop the wedding. They'll do, they'll do it all by themselves. I have to tell JJ the great news. Hey, babe, how's it going? 
I have great news. I'll tell you as soon as I get home. That's not all you'll be doing when you get home. Cool your jets, Buster. But it's good news. I'll see you soon. It's a text from Brody. Call me, please. I missed you. I miss us. What am I supposed to do with that? Brody, I'm sorry this sucks, but you're with Elias. Be with Elias. Is everything okay, sweetheart? Everything is wonderful, Daddy. Be with Elias. Is everything okay? Yeah, it's fine. The teddy bear you bought for the baby is wonderful. I really do love it. It's nothing. No, it's not nothing. It means the world to me. Whatever. As long as the baby's healthy, that's all I care about. Are you going to the doctor's appointments tomorrow with me tomorrow? Sure. I'll see you then. Thank you, Brody. I hate this. I really do. We shouldn't be doing this. It's not right. Not right? Do you have any idea how much damage Brody Kaysen has caused? Still, don't be silly, Elle. You're pregnant. Brody is the father. But, Elise, Brody is the father, right? Okay, Lola. Brody is the father. Something's... Yeah, and... Hold up. Never mind. And when you get married, we all get stupid rich. It's perfect. Totally. Oh my god! I can tell, like, Alice doesn't want to be part of us. I knew. I, I can tell by the look of her, her face. They they all want to marry Brody she, to get the money. Oh, my God. That's like, that's like a gold digger. Gold digger's story. And I know there is one gold digger story that I'm not ready to tell yet. In public, yet. Not yet. But anyways, anyway, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys ne next time. A double troublemaker. Well, later.